How about you there, rest of the world? This is Mad Attack. Uh, I'm trying something different today. I'm going to play somebody else's single player map and attempt to do commentary to it. Uh, this is one that demands a, a bit of concentration, so I'll, I'll try to. And you got to be fast, so I'll do my best to talk about it while I go. Um, this is The Other Side by CN2MC. Uh, just one that always stood out to me amongst the other single player maps posted there. Uh, you know, I'll try my best to go over it as we go along. Here we go. And we're going to then control group my men here, because there's a lot of time triggers in this. Yes, I did cheat and look at the INI file, but I uh, wanted to try to do it justice. And what I like about this one is it really revolves a lot around luring guys out. It's great, you don't want to go too north here because um, there's an Apache that'll freaking smoke your guys. Okay, so. I'm trying to remember the order. I find best to do it. Once again, time is of the essence of this one, but. Uh, one thing that really stood out to me it's a beautiful, well put together map. Um, a lot of Kara's making sure it looks good, which is something I always appreciate. Nothing turns me off from playing a map more than when somebody didn't give a shit about uh, lining up tiles. God damn it, I lost my bazooka guy. That was kind of important. Oh well, let's keep going. Uh, now we're going to do some more distractions down here. See if I can make it with that lost bazooka guy. That's going to be kind of tough. And it's about distracting with this minigunner. Killing these guys because they trigger reinforcements. Which is, I got no problem with that, that's a good idea. Right, let's get the fuck back over here. Okay, I don't know what that guy is. Ah, it's a neutral house or something. I do not control that guy. He's gonna go start some crap for me. That's this is definitely a random mission. I have a lot of problems having stuff to consistently happen, um, but whatever. Let's go. I'm oh, good. They're attacking that guy for me. That is awesome. Oh, that is awesome. I've got a present for you, motherfucker. Hopefully nobody spawns out of this, but I always tends to, right? Ooh, hey, what do you know? Okay. Not too bad so far. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, now I'm actually gonna move everybody back over here. Um Let's see if I can lure this tank out. I've done it before, but it's especially I lost one of my freaking bazooka guys. This is gonna be tough. It's gonna require quite a bit of micro. Come on, baby. Ah, oh, motherfucker. Excellent, there we go. I guess he has to hit me, actually. saving and loading up here because there's some stuff I want to illustrate. Uh, some consistency issues with it. I mean just, I don't, I must be the only person in the world still making maps for this, but uh, if anybody else is interested, that's really why I'm, I'm posting this stuff and what it takes to make a good level. And Because I think I, I even have a lot of lessons to learn on that. Okay. 
So we made it this far, so I'm going to be cheap and save it. There we go. <coughs> Alrighty. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right, and here's the thing, you have a two engineers. Yes, sir. You got what do we capture with those two engineers? We'll take a look and see what's over here. Kill these fucks real quick. Okay, and I'm gonna stop for a second and talk about this because I remember the first time I played the mission. I saw I had an APC with two engineers. Naturally, I'd think to capture the power plant in the hand of Nod so I can produce men. Uh, I wasn't exactly aware there's a big river up here you need a helicopter to get across. It's a confusing situation. It's not really spelled out in the, in the uh, briefing, uh, but I'll, I'll show you what happens when you do different things, okay. Now, again, let's save it. Hopefully I'm not running out of time too much here. Okay, I'm going to start by doing what I normally would do. I forget exactly what triggers what, but I know it's bad to capture the hand and not. And I would have thought that would be one of the things I want to capture. Okay. Oh, look. Building. Man, I got enough money, I can build an engineer. I don't see anything else around here. <gasps> what's going on? That triggered something. And what's this? I had a man pop out up there. That's kind of whack, but whatever you see. Um, that's some of the issues here, you know. It's a little bit confusing uh, as to what you're supposed to capture, but let me just load it back up again because you're really you're supposed to capture the communication center um, all right let's do this what do I do with the second engineer why do I have two engineers I'll show you what capturing the communication center reinforces that helicopter for me to to capture with the other engineer. Another confusing thing is you can capture with the commando. Obviously you don't want to do that all the time in all these situations. Okay, now let's hurry up and load this guy up. Take my bazooka. And of course my commando, some minigunners. Gotta hurry. I love this little island here. Again, that's what I was saying. It's very creative use of tiles because you gotta really manipulate some stuff to make something like that happen. You can't really do it naturally. Okay, uh, let's go. Okay. Oops. Shoot, I forgot to control group my guy. Oh well. Let's see what we got over here. Hey, it's an orca. Let's move him over here. Move the commando back. Okay. Well, that guy's useless. These guys are useless now, but we'll just protect our stuff, I suppose. And we're actually going to load this engineer up there in a second and capture the hand and nod. Get in there, sucker. Because it makes bazooka men. I notice I do not have bazooka men there now. Capture the hand and nod. I will. I won't go into the how weird the build level is for each side and inconsistencies, but that's just the way it is. Okay, we're gonna make sure that's primary. Okay. You don't. Know 
Uh, we got that wonderful worker there. Kill this flamer. Oh, shoot. Oh, shit. I don't think that was good. Oh, let's keep going. Too bad I can't sell the hospital. We set off, must have set off an altered hunt trigger if that's what's going on there. Again, inconsistencies left and right. But, I don't know, I just, something about this map I really like. It's, it's ambitious. Well, might as well sell that. Uh oh. They're chasing my guys. Ooh, look at that. See if I still got a shot of beating this. Oh, wait, I need engineers, don't I? Fuck, I think I fucked up big time. Alright. There we go. Something got reinforced. What got reinforced? Where's my reinforcements at? Okay. Because the goal in this mission is to capture the... Uh, Shut down, don't get shot down. Alright, I think we might have this in the bag. Mm. Let's capture those two things. Alright. Poof. I think we got it. Boom. Alright. Good, I'm glad I beat it, cuz that was like the fifth take and I don't want to have to do it again but uh, now that I got a second to breathe let me go over some of the stuff I wanted to talk about the map itself beautiful I'm a sucker for a beautiful map again I don't know if I said this this time but somebody didn't take the time to line up their cliffs make their shores look good I'm not interested in, in playing it because to me it's a sign they didn't put any thought into the scripting of it or the concept or, or whatever um, this mission is very ambitious, uh, you know, he's thinking big, uh, it's, th having the two structures, like the, the refinery and the tech center, were the two goals there, technically you could have blown them up and you wouldn't lose, but then you wouldn't be able to win, it's like a catch-22, there's kind of complicated ways around that, but it's thinking big, like, I've often done this myself. You come up with a great idea, and then you forget you don't actually don't test your proof proof of concept first, which is something I have to remind myself to do. I've learned that lesson way too many times. Uh, it's a small map, which it sets it apart. You know, everybody wants to make them as big as possible, especially with this where it's dealing with infantry. You don't want to spend all day walking all the way across the map. So I really like that. It, that's another thing that made it stand out to me. Um, it's like you have just the right amount of units to complete the mission and you better use them good I mean look at me I I, I effed up a lot but uh, I mean I looked at the INI file I've played it a bunch of times so you know that evens it out a little bit but uh, that's what I like you have very really limited resources and you better make the best of them uh, that's a lesson I really can learn uh, 
downside of it, you know, again, I may have mentioned this, it's really unclear what you're supposed to do, again, with capturing the communication center, uh, you know, it, it, it could be better, uh, more concisely iterated. Uh, let's see, uh, just on a technical level, uh, every, all the reinforcements worked good that time, but there's been times where you know, when I went to the village and killed the guys to reinforce the jeep and some other guys, I only had the jeep show up. Um, I didn't really go in there and, and mess with stuff, uh, go in the I and I file and mess with stuff. But I think it's sometimes I think if the uh, the reinforcement teams are have too many units in them or mixed units, they seem to not work as well. Just to be thorough, I always do mine sort of individually. Uh, some of the consequences are just too dire. I know I probably sound hypocritical if you ever played any of my missions because I, I make them too hard. I went, yeah, that's something I need to tone down, really, I think. I want people to play the missions. Um, but like capturing the hand and nod, all kinds of bad stuff happens, you know. Like I th that's what set off uh, the base getting attacked in the Northeast. Uh, but again, it's just something about the map. It's it's small. It, it's a challenge. It's like a puzzle. You know, I mean, I read a really good article the other day about what it takes to make a good RTS level. Um, I'll, I'll I'll link to it in the description, and I think this really hits a lot of the marks there. It attempts to hit a lot of the marks there, and half of them it does successfully. And uh, I don't know. I hope that wasn't too boring. Uh, thanks to CN2MC for making the map and uh, give me permission I asked him if it was cool if I uh, did this because you know obviously gonna be a little bit critical of it but uh, and that's pretty much it have a nice life.